Hi there, my name is Paul. I decided to do this video from the comfort of my easy chair just to be different. This is, in effect, a reply to myself in view of my previous, for lack of a better term, rant. In fact, I used that phrase on the previous video about my inability to get this camera working so that I could use it to put videos up on YouTube. Well, it wasn't the camera didn't work. It's that I couldn't figure out how to be able to use the film video that the camera produces. Well, what happened is there are a few errors in my video. First, Windows Movie Maker does not produce move files such as used by QuickTime. It produces WMV files. And yes, Microsoft Windows Movie Maker still crashes when you try to feed it AVI files. But, apparently, which I didn't notice, there is a conversion program that came with this camera that converts the AVI files to WMV files. But, it doesn't tell me that. What I had to discover was is that I have to ask it to convert files over to a format which is readable by the Microsoft Zune Z-U-N-E, media player, which uses WMV files. And those, that it converts over to a format that Windows Movie Maker can then read. So it is possible for me to now edit my videos with Windows Movie Maker. But that still brings up the thing is that I don't see or haven't noticed, and maybe somebody can tell me, you can, you can send me an email if you do, on some form of you know, good quality, open source video editing, even if it has to be, even if I have to do it from Linux. I don't need to be able to read the camera, I just need to be able to edit files, and specifically, a, either specifically AVI or WMV. I can work with, I can work with AVI files now, so if it'll work with AVI or if it'll work with WMV, um, fine, whatever. That's what I'd like to see. If it isn't, I may have to start doing some programming and start working on something myself which is typically how a lot of open source packages got developed. Someone had an itch and wrote a program to scratch the itch. So we'll see what happens. But anyway, so that's my more or less correction to my previous video. And now I'm going to use my remote control and uh, end the video. Um, I guess that's it. And now when I wave my hand, it isn't like the audio comes about three quarters of a second after, so I can say, "Oh, can't do it." Bye. Oh, I thought that was going to do it. Bye.